One more. I'm doing one more episode tonight since we were visited by Wyvern Gaming. One more. Can't promise it's going to be long, but I'd also like to see the end of the city and the stars, so I feel like we made good progress today. Hello, hello, greetings, greetings. Uh, we don't need his parcel, even though it might have some incriminating evidence in it. You'll never guess. Wow, this place is full of guards. Why does he need any more guards? How did you get in here? I'm your private guard. Also, I'm supposed to be a movie star. You! You're not one of my guards. What are you doing here? Oh, my law. Captain! Captain! That's the minister! Mr. Clark! Wow, way oh, to blow wow. our cover, Parvati. We're supposed to be UDL so, people. this is one of the guys who runs the colony, huh? Small room for a big shot. You're saying you got a small if dick, Clark. If this is Clark. about another Aether Wave clip or radio spot, you may kindly fuck off, as the parlance goes. It's the parlance. I'm not doing anymore. In colloquial. Uh, in colloquial. <laughs> Fuck it right back. Cut the crap. I'm here for dimethyl sulfide. I'm here for dimethyl sulfide. What are you talking about? Why would I want something like that? Cut the crap. You slaughtered all his guards. Nice, Jeremiah. Drugs, of course. What else would it be? I don't have any drugs. You should try a vending machine or a purveyor of curative goods. He's got no idea what we're asking about. Oh, he does. Will that be all, then? Now, you're speaking awful loudly. Seems like you're trying to... Uh, I have records proving you're hoarding diamonds of sulfide. They're not drugs or chemicals, and you haven't been ordering them. Who has? I didn't come all this way to play games, Clark. It's your name on the receipts. Who has? Of elimination. The only other person with access? Of course, of course. It's Rockwell again. Who else? And I thought he was only holding me here to keep me out of the so way. So he's not actually the bad guy. Back up and tell me what you're talking about. Chairman Rockwell. He's kept me under house arrest for years. I've long suspected him of transacting business in my name. Oh man, your comment, Jeremiah, is not aging well. Turns out this might not be the bad house. guy. Would would you like me to make you tea? Please, this is important. Whatever it is that brought you here, Rockwell's the one behind it. I mean, he does have a villainous name. Why would he go through all this trouble? How should I know? I've been under house arrest for years. But there is a way to find out, and perhaps to set things right. Whatever Rockwell's doing, he'll be doing it from the HHC headquarters. Your best lead is to look for details in his office. This all feels off, Captain. Like when there's a storm coming, but everything's quiet and still. Believe me. Shut up, Parvati. Things have been <laughs> off around here for a very, very long time. A reckoning is most certainly due. I would say. We really gonna do this? Getting involved is a messy business, and it rarely pays. This is about That's what the crew turned it's... against me. This is about the survival of the colony. But we do get if paid, you don't right? Help, who will? Why, this is starting to sound like an issue of dissident hunter. I was trying to like you, Clark. I was trying to like you until that comment. You seem a little too excited by all this. We're discussing industrial espionage, legal redress, the possible salvation of Halcyon. Is this not exhilarating? Not unless we also get paid also, at the end of that this sentence. this is the longest conversation I've had with someone else in quite some time. Welcome to COVID-19. At any rate, I'm glad to have someone else on my side. If you're the best colony, <laughs> if you're the best this colony has to offer, we're screwed. Uh, let's try to be friends with him. I dearly hope I'm not imagining this. Now we've got to get into the HHC. That's in the Acropolis district along with the other major corporate and government facilities. But only board employees are allowed into the district. There's a heavily guarded checkpoint just down the street. There might be a route through the maintenance tunnels, but I'm afraid I don't know specifics. If you can kill 10 rats in the Bard's basement. For obvious reasons. 
Right now, I don't know the specifics. Most people avoid the area for obvious reasons. Uh, what then? If you guards don't scare me, the tone sounds good. I prefer a quiet approach. What's, what then? When you reach the HHC building, this access card should get you up to the executive suites, where the chairman's office and what used to be my office are. What used to be your office? Oh, I haven't been allowed up there in years. I shudder to think what Rockwell's done with the place. A gilded minibar, perhaps? A personal theater? A man has too much money and too little sense. How did you manage to hang on to your access card? The board's lackeys are none too bright. I simply claimed I'd lost it and hid it somewhere no one would think to look. Do I want to know? I merely hid it in a book. No one reads anything longer than a few pages around here. There are a few advantages to dealing with imbeciles. Well, thanks for your help. Wait. Rockwell has one of the only terminals capable of transmitting to the Earthbound message drone. This is our chance. Please, take this and transmit it from his office. Rockwell hasn't given me any messages from Earth for years. He's desperate. I think we caught a message from Earth. Earth. There was like thousands of them in that but one satellite early in the game here. that we explored. But they need to know what's happening here. Uh, why are you trusting me to help you and count on me? It's on the cartridge. What isn't on it is the real question. I've gathered meeting minutes, internal messages, sustainability reports, and more, all exposing the corruption and mismanagement plaguing Halcyon. You and uh, Phineas Once seem like you're in a good Earth place to try to restore some have to send help. stability to they this place. Get here for, I don't even know. Shouldn't we do something our own selves? Yeah, we're going to have to. It's worth a try, but the Earth Directorate still needs that message. We must hope for their intervention. How long will that take? Depending on the nature of their response, months at least, perhaps years. Organizing and sending personnel all the way out here is no mean feat. But if it works, it'll be worth it. Perhaps there is hope after all. And now I entrust it to you. Good luck. And trust no one in the Acropolis district. I suppose we'll be on our way then. Hey, soldier. You can't just wander around the minister's residence. What do you think you're doing? Just had a great conversation with the minister. You've always loved the cantina bar. You'll respect your wife. You'll love your children. You'll die early and tragically. Me? I'm watching for suspicious activity. Well, do a better job, soldier. Well, when you What's put so it suspicious that way, about a fellow guard? Look, I don't have any visitors. On Bye. What door do we come in? I mean, hey. Hey, hey, hey. So. The Lying Earth. Dude, that is from uh, Hyperion. The poet who writes the Hyperion cantos in the book Hyperion, his famous novel in his story is uh, The Dying Earth. Martin Silenus. This book is just teeming with science fiction references out of this game. Okay. Minister Clark wants to, uh, knows nothing about the dimethyl sulfide. I explained that Chairman Rockwell has actually been keeping him under house arrest. Clark is certain Rockwell is behind the purchase of the chemicals. The maintenance tunnels b beneath Byzantinium connect to the Acropolis district. We have more than one marker. So it should just be Chairman's office. Yeah, but where's the Acropolis? 
Needs to be to the Acropolis. Hopefully it just leads to the tunnels. Oh there. That's one right there. Oh, it needs Can't English. You just see the Probably a quest. Propriety radiating off of her. What the fuck's your problem, what? bitch? How splendid. Another rung leech wandering through the streets of Byzantium. You're gonna Why, get just yours. This morning I thought to myself, as lovely as the gardens are, what they really need is more greasy vagrants frolicking through them. It's probably through the chairman. You are. Towards the chairman's Rob. office. I hope it's to the so sewer, so I want to sneak in. I don't want to go in guns blazing because I've been real careful with reputation. Here you are, frolicking. Uh, I hardly call my present attire greasy. Just now I thought I'd really like to sock this lady in the face. By frolic? Hey, it's nothing to be ashamed of. Own it. Well, whatever you call it, do it elsewhere. And take your merry band with you. Honestly, what is the board thinking letting so many of your ilk into the city proper? It's madness. Are you a part of the Mohawk tribe? Hey, lady, that's cultural appropriation. If the board isn't supposed to let people into the city, how'd you get here? I hey, earned my place here, just like everyone else. My grandfather was the CIO at Tile, you see. Oh. Wait, but what did you do? I just told you. My grandfather made millions of bits as CIO, and I earned them from him. <laughs> Inheriting isn't the same as earning. Of course it is. Wealth is the most visible, objective measure of success. And success isn't given to you, it's earned. My grandfather taught me that. If you have wealth, you're successful, and if you're successful, you must have earned it. Honestly, it's a simple concept. Chief Idea Officer. He came up with all the best Chief ideas idea for their officer. products. Chief Idea Officer. You know the font they use for Stogie Slims? That was him. Well, he described the idea of it to their font development team, then picked it from a list of choices, but that's basically the same thing. It was a very long list. What other eyes did he come up, ideas did he come up with? Let's see. He picked the colors they included in Rainbow Chips. No one else wanted purple. But he insisted. Everyone loves the purple ones. <laughs> and you know how the Cosmic Smokes logo has an eye in the middle of a heptagon? He said that one came to him in a dream. He was a true visionary. Yes. So far ahead of his time. I see. Thanks. You're welcome. Now, do we have any further business, or are you just here for the repartee? Uh, I thought we were going to correct you being an asshole. What's wrong with more people coming to Byzantinium? What's wrong? It erodes the very pillars of our society. Merit, decorum, personal hygiene. This city is meant for us, the system's finest. We earned its luxuries. But now we are overrun with the unworthy and the ungrateful, and this early retirement nonsense is making it even worse. What's early retirement? The worst thing to happen to Halcyon. A contest that gives even the lowliest and most inefficient workers a chance to live in Byzantium. By simply winning a lottery, those early retirees get an exclusive district of Byzantium to themselves. No one else is even I allowed I saved my to game and it. killed this chick. <laughs> Tell me, how is that fair? Uh, because Soylent Green is people. Well, most contests have some inherent bias, so technically... Oh, by the law. I mean the principle of it, not the mechanics. It's not right. I deserve to see any district I please. Why, if it weren't guarded, I'd... Hmm. Why I'd... You know, why I'd... Put him up, put him up, put him up. What say I hire you to investigate this travesty, and you get paid to do so? So, in other words, Jeremiah, you She's went through this thing being a We're warlord. We're probably gonna get shot at anyway. Jeremiah Might as did well make full a few warlord murder yes. playthrough. Listen to your... Your... He's a goddamn doctor, what you bitch. What is that person's job, exactly? Are they your secretary? They're a doctor. Masseuse, or do you just keep them around as a mobile They're a armies? doctor, ain't awards. What is this? Horden well, these will be? What's important is that you think this is a fabulous arrangement. All right, hootin' handy anal beads. Aren't you? Horton handy anal beads, yes, I'll do your thing, but she's a doctor. You're thrilled to lend me your services, aren't you? Sure. Fantastic. Consider yourself employed, Vagrant. Whatever, anal the beads. Chosen retirees all enter the retirement district. You know Soylent Green's going to be people. But it's completely locked you know this down. is going to be you a hellhole work-labor camp. Unless, of course, you had a wealthy, beautiful benefactor of impeccable social pedigree. Which you do. 
How fortunate for you. These codes will get you past the lockdown. Oh, and don't worry about subtlety. I don't care how you deal with security, just correct, just correct the injustice. The injustice. <laughs> Anal beads, how'd you do it? The same way anyone gets anything here, of course. Money. I made friends with the right people. Bits might earn you a place in Byzantium. Read some palms, baby. Everyone here has little need for more of them. For favors like this, you need to spend... Let's call it social capital. So, you got on them knees. And you got them cheeks clapped, and then you had to scratch out your scabies. Bye-bye. Have a good time. I'm a little worried that the events that are about to take place. The Acropolis oh. district is off limits. Move along. Where I just need to get into the sewer. Can I just crawl into the sewer? Hey, mind if I take a breather? You could have asked me, you know. What in the law's name are you on about? I'm filthy fucking rich. Oh man, that's a lot of money, but. We have been hoarding it. I was gonna bribe you. Honest mistake. Why don't you come back? <laughs> Honest mistake. From the top? <laughs> yes, of course. Goodbye. You want to try this bribery thing again? <laughs> Honest mistake. Where the hell's the sewers? It is just a guide straight to it. Well, I see a bunch of sewer grates, so on his mistake. There's my parents' place. Smell that? Nice thing about traveling with the captain. We meet all sorts of new people. All right, let's talk to your damn parents since we're here and I can't find the sewers. Empty man. Pheromone glad glands. Felix. Arvati. Ellie's parents. Byzantinium. Ellie hasn't spoken to her parents in a long time. She thinks it's high time she check on them. Sure. Best part is when they pay us. We never really had new folks in Edgewater, except the captain. Kind of hard to make new friends when everyone's already decided they don't like you. Could be a favor in disguise. A lot of people out here ain't that nice. Parvati, don't you open your mouth again until I've gotten a bite of that $3,000 casserole and you've paid back your loan with interest. Oh my god, look at this opulence. You guys are living it up. This is a... It's a Roman home, a domino. Domo? Domo? Domo, I think it is. I know this is considered stealing. Your parents are filthy freaking rich, Ellie. But to be fair to you, you went to medical school. You earned it. You're a doc. Marilyn, is that you? Laws, we certainly didn't expect to see you like this. And I didn't expect you to renew your marriage contract. But we're all full Ouch. of surprises today, aren't we? Ouch. Yes. <laughs> Speaking of surprises, you should meet my new friend. We've been running around the system for a while now, stirring up all sorts of trouble. Making bits, spending them of late. Uh, spit on floor, fancy place. I'll probably be taking a few things with me. Oh, man, what should we do here? What should we do? Ellie asked us to be assholes. Oh, Ellie asked us to be assholes. Fuck it. There you go again, Captain. Always menacing, polite society. Anyway, you're probably wondering where I've been all this time. <laughs> just spit on the floors. <laughs> Not <clears throat> exactly. Lionel Witherspoon. It's been a bloody haze. You wouldn't believe the messes we've gotten ourselves into. Right? Squat down on the ground, take a deuce, smear it on the walls. Save towns and restored property across Halcyon. Yep, we're a pair of disgraceful lowlifes. Marilyn, this really isn't the best time. Uh, perhaps you should go. This is some cold shit. 
We'll leave when we're good and ready. <clears throat> uh, I'm gonna say this is getting awkward. That means it's getting fun. We'll stay as long as we like. And while we're at it, we'll drink your expensive hooch, wear our outside shoes all over your nice floors. Uh, keep going, Ellie. What is it? It's the floors. You had the floors redone with real Terran marble? Since when can you afford that? That's what we've been trying to tell you, dear, but you must understand, we hadn't heard from you in ages. We thought you were dead. Oh, this is going to be brutal. Uh... Don't, you don't sound so disappointed about it. I'm not dead. I just never wanted to talk to you again. I'm afraid the distinction was lost on us, darling. Oh, God. Oh, damn it. Our fucking food and drug withdrawal has screwed us again. We should have max perception, basically. Yeah, go full nine yards here. Damn it. What did you do? Why, we did what any grieving parents would do. We collected on your life insurance policy. And the payouts have been rather uh, substantial. You what? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Oh. Talking about making lemon slap out of lemons. Oh. <laughs> I want to I want to do Ellie's quest and stuff though. Of course. And we shall always harbor that joyful secret deep within our hearts and you'll report it to the insurance company right it's not that simple for one thing we'd have to cut back on so many necessities the neighbors would be sure to notice so tell them ellie's back you'll be the talk of the town let's inquiry Quietly. Uh, let's go, Ellie. We've got better things to do than hang around these two. Damn right, Captain. Fine. I'm gone. Forever this time. That went well. Hey, man. Parents who truly love their children. I'm going to teach you guys a hard lesson. They never give up hope. You motherfuckers. Let me hear your stupid ass names. You old hag. What in the void did you do? I didn't like how things went down either, but did you have to go and kill them? Wow, there's actually dialogue for this. By now you should know how I handle things my way. That wasn't a problem before it meant killing my folks in their own home. You're on your own now. Consider my debt to you forgotten and cancelled. That's it? It sure better be. Now go! Wow. If you kill him, she is not a happy camper. But it's cool that that's in the game. Yeah, I mean, I wasn't going to go down that route anyways, because I wasn't actually, uh, you know, whatever. But... Mostly, I'm just trying to get close with let's Ellie. Let's talk outside. Yeah, let's talk outside. I still think we did the right thing by talking to uh, her parents the way she wanted us to, even though it might have made them feel guilty to know that Ellie's actually like a good person and doing good things. It's cool they programmed that in the game, though.
All the bones in that work. thing. Can you believe those two? We'd hardly been there a minute and they turned us out like yesterday's garbage. Uh, they shouldn't have gotten so upset. How did you think that would go? We were making quite the scene. They shouldn't have gotten so upset. I wanted them to get upset. I just thought it would play out differently. They'd both be sitting there watching one of their vapid aether wave dramas. We need to freaking and eat and drink so we in, can actually have our stats for these conversations. These flaws are annoying. And the glass would shatter all over their overpriced marble. Father would tear all off right, Ellie, you got some definitely some open mouth. Chip on your shoulder, unresolved mommy and daddy issues. I get it, but then what? I'd have a great one-liner in the tube. I was thinking either the leather's fake, but the scars are real. Yeah, that's huh? a pretty good one. Oops, did I just track awesome onto your rug? That one's not as good. So pissed about this food and drug flaw. It's really f screwing the playthrough up. We should have Intimidate. We have that stat. Father would throw his hands up because this would be just like me to come back and make a big scene. Then Mother would do the old, you had us worried sick. Her eyes would be red and she'd have her fist in front of her mouth to stifle a sob. Uh, you're better than this. I just didn't want to get booted out of the house I grew up in like that. It's embarrassing, you know. And I've got a reputation to maintain. So we're starting to get into Ellie's person. She she acts stuff. She talks a big game, but inside. Uh it's a rough situation. This was sure the best. Um, Uh, I mean, I feel like it's for the best that she can be away from her parents, but... Hmm. It's a rough situation. I'm used to rough situations. Like when someone loads your pistol with blanks and strands you in a mirage. Yeah, I kind of figured she'd be like, yeah. in an airlock with an angry mantis warm. What happened with your parents is in the past now. This episode reflects on them, not you. But I want to talk about me now. It's up to you to determine what that is. Everyone's only out for themselves. You've got to surround yourself with people who will really look out for you. Uh, I'm going to go with this one. Unless you mean the kind who look out for you to blink so they could swipe your bits. The galaxy's not exactly crawling with those. Anyway, I don't want to sift through this lousy experience for meaningful life lessons. I'm mad, and I want to do something about it. Something like, wait a second, what if I could get that money? The money won't make you feel better about what happened. Keep talking. I could open a new account. We gotta go with our character. that account holder as a sole beneficiary, all the payouts would go to me. I'll make money without doing a thing. And I'll get to cut them off. So how do we do this? My policy is with the Greater Halcyon Insurance Group. They have an office in Byzantium. Maybe you could use some of your people skills to help well, if I'm not suffering from alcohol, now. drug and alcohol withdrawal, sure. If that doesn't work. I'm sure we can find one of their terminals and do it ourselves. I mean, this seems more like Ellie's style. I think really being too nice with her and being like, oh, life lessons is just not her thing. Saw a letter in their mailbox. They're in Fallbrook. What a relief. The less time we have to spend in Byzantium, the better. Something on your mind? Nothing, I guess. This one's complicated, but it's good. It's good video game writing. You know, there's not really a clean answer to to that whole situation, I feel like. Dr. Ellie, you ever wonder if maybe we got some things in common? Where is this, the sewer entrance? Maintenance cells beneath 
Byzantinium connect to the Acropolis district. Yeah, so many paths. So many paths. I think a lot of them would have cut the quest off totally. But I think just choosing the default, what seems like the best option, oh, here we go, was also a bad idea there. I mean, I don't know that for sure, but I just feel like Ellie was always sort of amoral and just out to make money and stuff, so it didn't really fit her character to be too nice about things. Seems like maybe where the sewers would start. Oh, the water actually flows. That's kind of cool. I am so freaking sick of drug and alcohol withdrawal. Real slick. <laughs> Try to at least get in here before this episode's over. Oh, but all this stuff's actually getting caught here. Damn it, the sewers. It's, oh, it's that dog. Why is there not a thing on the map? It's pretty plaza. Interior, landing ports, Let's see estates district. I don't see an entrance to sewers. But we're gonna keep looking. That's the route I think is best, and I don't, I don't want to bribe them. We've, that three thousand dollar casserole put a real hurting on our money, and I kind of want to do that. I just want to do the sewer route anyway. Underneath Byzantinium. Underneath. Oh, here we go. I'm mean, it's on my legally allotted break. Really, I'm supposed to be here. <laughs> oh, um, what are you doing here? Really? What are you doing here? Nothing. Nothing. Why? Uh, does it does it uh, look like I'm up to something? Scientist, overly nervous, trying to explain Laws, a few boys here. When uh, not acting me. natural. I'm Ooh. caught, aren't I? Uh, yeah, you're in big trouble. Uh, why don't you tell me what you did? I work in the lab at the Ministry of Accuracy and Morale. Some of my sprats went missing, but it's not my fault, okay? Maybe I let them out more often than regulations allow, but they need to stretch their little legs. Oh. And so what if I occasionally forgot to latch their cage? Everyone gets a little distracted now and then. Calm down. Tell me what happened. They escaped, it's fetch quest time. And before them back, they'd made their way to the maintenance tunnels. Even if I did dare go down there, they're among all the common sewer sprats and exterminator mechanicals. I'll go look for your sprats. Really? Like every planet so in far, and every area has had a sprat crate. quest. Six of my little ones are down there, but don't worry. You oh. can easily tell them apart from common sewer sprats. They have intelligent eyes, an agreeable yet reserved demeanor, and a fondness for hiding. Also, oh, yeah. they're white rather than green. This man lost his virginity Please, to a goat. Do take care. There's, there's zero do doubt about that one. Mechanicals. If the worst should happen this guy to got into goat fucking in his well, spare time. I still want their bodies. For science, of course. Yes, for science, sure. Uh, what are the maintenance tunnels under beneath the Zenitanium for? Well, to maintain things, of course. Like yes. big humming machine things with gears. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And pipes. Water pipes. Air pipes. A world of pipes. of pipes. That's why they connect the city from the Acropolis district to here. But why won't you go into the tunnels? Everyone knows sewer sprats carry diseases. And the exterminator mechanicals have been known to I thought to they had intelligent eyes targets. and calm demeanors. Why they do that when they're only supposed to attack sprats, I've no idea. But there are rumors. There are rumors. Some people say there are strange things in those tunnels. Oh my. Assassins, a room full of murderous automechanicals, monsters hungry for human flesh, a hidden bureaucratic purgatory where things and people are lost forever. Not that I place any stock in more locks, of course. Which is why you sounded so deadly in earnest. Why are there exterminator mechanicals in the tunnels? To deal with the sewer sprats, of course. They're quite the nuisance. I'm wondering why you're so attached to these sprats. Therefore, my, um, research. And? Out with it. Oh, very well. It's true. I do run studies on them at the lab, but I also have a special connection with them. See, I'm an enormous fan of all my colonists. 
The early seasons, before the plot lines got tacky. You must have seen the classic episodes. Yeah, great stuff, really. Positively marvelous. Those early years truly were the golden age of Halcyon. Well, I name all my sprats after my favorite characters. That way, their stories can live on in rodent form. Totally and completely so normal it's behavior. So that I get them all back. Otherwise, the show's canceled. So your sprats, what are their names? Not just names. They all have backstories, too. Oh, good. There's Lord Reginald Kim the Third, uh, Lady Philippa Farnsworth, right. Vonda von Vermington, Haroon Greenley, Iskander Emmanuel Sanchez, sure. and Evelyn Ensley Okoye. Right. Who are Lord Reginald and Lady Philippa? Philippe. Ah, she's the chief executive of Farnsworth ah. Incorporated and a fearless captain of industry. He's a mercurial shareholder. They're in a rather. You thought all those things out, contract. Wyvern. Thought all of these things out, man. What's Vonda's story? She's an ambitious shareholder in Farnsworth Incorporated who wants more than stock. Or does she? Oh. It's bum, difficult bum, to bum. tell what exactly she's after, but she is trying to seduce both Lord Reginald and Lady Philippa. I'm curious about Horin Grule. So is everyone. Harun is a mysterious young man with amnesia. His backstory is still a work in progress. Iskander is Lady Philippa's trusty assistant. He's trying to seduce Vonda. What the hell are we listening to right now? Or is Greeley? Reminds me of something. It's like this stupid ass Horace Greeley, supposedly this great rider on a horse. Horace Greeley was so fast. Who's Evelyn Ensley Okoya? She's a member of Farnsworth. Man, is such a nerd, but it's great. A wise woman with a sharp tongue and a heart of gold. Okay, uh, I don't need to hear about this. Something else? You seem surprised. I, I feel like we just got trolled by the game devs. That was a troll specifically for those of us that go down all the conversation options, hoping that we can unlock something. I still am. After all, I'm a person of oh. and only middling prospects. No one does favor. <laughs> but I must say, I'm far too distressed to think critically about your suspiciously kind offer. About them bits. Farewell. I'll see in parcel service. <clears throat> I mean, this has got to be it. This is the maintenance tunnel. It's got to be. What's this? Oh, this probably ties into the insurance thing, right? Maybe we had to go to Fallbrook for that. Let's at least hit the tunnels before we... The car at night. Place is... This is definitely not the maintenance zone. This place looks great. I'm sure we'll come back here. Oh, that's new. Bijour, 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 ravi, ravu. When your inhaler finishes off a stack of consumables, it will automatically reload itself with another stack of the same type. Does seem like a good place to stop when you get to it. Yeah, it's feeling that way. I think this is going down to the maintenance tunnel. Yeah, maintenance tunnel's discovered. We did it. We did it. All right, I'm gonna quit. I think that is a good stopping point.